I think slowly but surely the Tesla's competition is becoming insane. Toyota yesterday revealed production version of BZ4X electric vehicle SUV. Toyota unveiled additional information on its first fully electric vehicle, the BZ4X. The SUV is a pioneer within Toyota and its genetics are shared with the Subaru Solterra. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please give us thumbs up if you find this information interesting and subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news after years of defending the virtues of hybrid vehicles Toyota seems to finally make the leap into fully electric models it all comes to fruition this week with the global announcement of the production version of the Toyota BZ4X a model that will initially be marketed in Japan this is the first all-electric model in a long line according to Toyota I I personally like the look. What do you think, friends? Do you like it? I find it very interesting, very sharp, nice the design. I, I like it. So the vehicle is based on Toyota's dedicated battery electric vehicle platform called Itinga. This platform was unveiled in conjunction with Subaru, which for its part will use it as the basis for the Subaru Solterra, its first electric vehicle. To situate you, the vehicle will fit into the compact SUV segment, its dimensions are similar to the Toyota RAV4, it is just a little smaller and it is going to have up to 200 miles, 280 miles of range, that's 450 kilometers. So according to the first published data, the Toyota BZ4X electric SUV will offer a 71.4 kilowatt hour battery placed in the floor to lower the vehicle's center of gravity like usually we have the case with electric vehicles and promote better weight distribution between the front and rear seats. I mean, between the front and rear. Even if the manufacturer has not officially published the values, it envisages a range of about 280 miles of range, uh, 450 kilometers according to WLTP standards. So a little less according to our EPA standards. The manufacturer also mentions having added a heat pump in order to reduce the loss of autonomy linked to the heating of the passenger uh, compartment. Um, uh, so the versions will be offered from uh, front wheel drive and all wheel drive. The first will have a 150 kilowatt electric motor developing 201 horsepower and producing 195 pound feet of torque. According to Toyota, the 0 to 60 acceleration would be uh, crossed in just 8.4 uh, seconds from 0 to 60 miles. Now, as for the all-wheel drive version, it will be equipped with a pair of 80 kilowatt uh, electric motors, one positioned at the front, the other at the rear. Combined power will be about 215 horsepower for 248 pound feet of torque, allowing the vehicle to sprint from 0 to 60 miles in just over 7.7 .7 seconds. Not bad, right? The vehicle will be able to recover 80% of its load in 30 minutes. Toyota will also offer a solar panel to also on BZ4X to also ensure the recharging of the battery. It will, by the way, speaking of recharging of the battery, look my next report about what Toyota is doing on patent, what patent it's using to recharge your car on the move. It will also be equipped, I mean the BZ4X will be also equipped with a fully computer pipe steered by wire therefore without any mechanical connection the bz4x is part of toyota's new beyond zero brand friends which will include all of the manufacturers battery electric vehicles details of canadian products will be shared in mid-november and uh, it's going to start in japan hopefully in the united states what next year toyota plans to introduce seven bz vehicles by 2025 well let me know your thoughts friends what do you think? Uh, uh, let me know your thoughts. How do you f uh, compare this to Tesla? Of course, this is the, not a Tesla Model X, but the competition is coming. Uh, for me, to me, it looks a very sharp design, good looking. RAV4 has been very popular in Toyota line, and now I think this BZ4X will have great success with consumers. Well, this is Armin Haryan from Torque
tesla.news.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla news give us thumbs up so you don't uh, and, and also ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage uh, peace be with all of you friends let me know your thoughts on toyota bz 4x coming and also I'll, let's move on to the next tesla story Future Toyota electric vehicles will wirelessly recharge each other on the move and this could cure those range anxiety worries. Toyota could be planning some game-changing electric vehicle technology. A Toyota patent hits at a development that could eliminate the worst part of electric vehicle ownership. Toyota builder of some of uh, uh, trucks and SUVs that are most popular in the world is often considered a laggard when it comes to electric vehicles but CarBuzz uncovered one of the Japanese company's US patent applications that suggests they could have some genuinely groundbreaking electric vehicle technology in the world. So I'm about to tell you what it is. Welcome back friends. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Please give us thumbs up and like this video and subscribe to our channel for daily electric vehicle news. So CarBuzz reports that Toyota may have pioneered the Prius years ago but when you think of a hybrid nowadays it's not necessarily the japanese eco warrior that instantly springs to mind anymore hydrogen is where toyota's priorities lie these days but however it is produced electric vehicles are certain to become a core part of the automaker's future earlier this year we learned that the japanese giant toyota was working on an electric truck but that's not very special these days anymore what is special is the innovation that CarBuzz has just discovered. According to patent documents, Toyota is working on a way to wirelessly recharge electric vehicles. And here is the kicker. The invention aims to do this while the cars are still moving. Amazing, isn't it? The patent documents reveal various methods of doing this. In the first one car, let's call it an electric Toyota Tundra from the future, could be driving along the highway. The driver realizes that the truck is almost out of, out of electricity, so he or she places an energy transfer request over a wireless connection to a second vehicle, say a Toyota Mirai or the production version of the Lexus LFZ concept. Once the request is accepted, a second wireless connection from an energy interface on the second vehicle to an energy interface on the first vehicle can be established. The requested amount of energy can then be transferred wirelessly. In other scenarios, the vehicles automatically place requests for energy transfers with each other, potentially through the use of a non-transitory computer readable medium. Cool, isn't it? The patent documents reveal that the systems would read traffic flow and determine the amount of time it would take for the energy transfer to be completed before making a connection, thus preventing early disconnections. They also suggest that these vehicles would be able to match speed with each other automatically and would be able to find a route that would provide a maximum efficiency of the transferring of the amount of energy. Energy. Do you know what comes to mind, friends? Good Samaritan. You're driving on the road. All of a sudden, you realize that a car on the same highway next to you needs energy and is requesting energy transfer, and you decide to be a Good Samaritan and help. Although you may be paid for this, there may be some fees involved in this, but, you know, why not help a neighbor? Essentially, these vehicles would be able to communicate with each other to make fast charging on the go as quick and effortless as possible, but as for or how the wireless connection could actually transfer energy, we can only assume that Toyota envisions a more powerful version of today's wireless vehicle chargers. What impact these would have on range and efficiency is yet to be determined, but if anyone can figure this idea out and see it through, Toyota surely can. Well, friends, let me know your thoughts. What do you think? I think this is a great idea. It's good that Toyota will come up with electric vehicles. You know, We're not surprised to hear that, but to have something like future Toyotas um, being able to wirelessly recharge each other on the move, and this could cure those range anxiety 
warriors and take the electric car ownership to a new totally new level well let me know if you're surprised on toyota i am um, but i'm not because also toyota is known to have lots of good patents and i'm looking forward for this technology to really come to fruition this is armin haryan from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily electric vehicle news coverage and give us thumbs up please share in social media if you found this report helpful i'll see you soon in our next report god bless you everyone and let's move on to the next ev story